<laughs> it's so cool. I just met somebody um, who's got a, a, a bulldog and it's a one and a half years old and it's really quite a large animal for one and a half years old, it's still a pup. Um, and I said to the gentleman, uh, what kind of dog is it? It's about, it's, um, it's, a, breeze, it's a breeze block on legs. <laughs> that was just so funny. Anyway, this is the 30 day magic challenge and this is day number, oh yes, first time I've probably mentioned it, day number 17 and <laughs> we're doing it. <laughs> breeze block on legs, <laughs> we're doing it right now. Yeah, sometimes the things that you have in life you, you really want to get rid of, you want to declutter, not just declutter one's house and declutter, but declutter your life. And sometimes we hold on to things that really aren't germane in helping us move forward because we're being held back because we've got an emotional attachment to them. So this is a really good um, exposition of things along that line. And we're going to be taking it right to the bench. This is really weird. Three pieces of rolled up packing tape, in of themselves, nothing, but it's what they represent. For example, the life that we live, you collect things, whether it's emotional baggage or whether it's physical goods, we all collect things. And it comes a time when you want to get rid of something that really doesn't fit in with your life anymore. And sometimes the things that you want to get rid of never got rid of. Maybe that's because you have an emotional attachment. I don't know. But the idea is that you actively make a conscious decision to get rid of something you don't want in your life, whether that's a physical good or whether that's an emotional experience. And if you're emotionally attached to things, it can prove to be quite a challenge to get rid of things that hold you back. I know this to be true for myself as I know of, of, know of other people in my life. So as I say, you might want to actually get rid of, for example, this and get rid of it. But unless you actively take active choices and active decisions, it always comes back. It's always there. So the idea would be to physically, physically remove it from your life to the degree that it's no longer there. But you still have an emotional attachment and it's still remains. So what's what's the idea? What can you do? Well, maybe change tack. Maybe the thing that you want to hold on to, let that go. And the thing you want to get rid of, hold on to that. But if you do that, you've got to be very, very wary of ending up with nothing. But then again, that could just be a new beginning. So there we have it. Um, yes, it's just a piece of magic, but hopefully it has some portents. Hopefully it has something that you can actually look at and go, oh, that makes sense. But listen, um, short video, not a big one. So if you want to watch any one of our other videos, just look at the one over there. Great. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.